up to the ring, Mike Cook. My name is Mike the Animal Cook. My fighting style is boxing slash submission fighting. And fighting Bobby Lashley, I know he was on TV as a wrestler. That's fine. He will shit his pants once he gets hit. And it's going to be very fast. It's going to be tap, tap, tap on his chin, and it's going to go straight to the ground, and he's going to be on his back. I'll be raising my hand. I will finish this fight in one of two ways. I will either make him tap out from punches, I will knock him out, or I'll, I'll throw a third one in for you guys, and I'll submit him. And now back up to Brad Kelly. And welcome into the ring, his opponent, Bobby Lashley. My name is Bobby Lashley. Fighting style is ground and pound. Well, I know he's going to brawl, so I'm going to bring it to him the same way he's going to bring it to me. It's going to be a very intense fight. We're just going to battle, brawl, and, and someone's going to drop. Someone's going to stay down. In a perfect world, I'd like to stand up for a while. I'd like to trade shots with him because that's what he likes to do. Um, take him down, slam him a couple times, really wear him out, let him back up, and then drop him. This fight means everything for my career. Every fight that I have means a tremendous amount for my career. I have to keep moving forward, I have to keep winning, and I gotta keep uh, moving up the ladder. complete package 33 year old Bobby Lashley I have never seen a fighter come into a bout as big of a favorite as Bobby Lashley is tonight according to Nick Kalikas he is over a 10 to 1 favorite that wow. is unheard of in only his third professional fight unheard of yes you said it right and I was talking about it I think the way to beat him is probably by way of submission because you know the fight's going to go to the ground then again, he's training with the American top team. <laughs> so, he's got a good submission defense. The, sure he does. The Tale of the Tape, sponsored by the Girlfriend Experience, available now on demand before it's in theaters. Check it out. Lastly, with a bit of a weight advantage, you look at this guy, he is a physical specimen. This guy is cut. Yeah, we talked about it now many times. Michael cannot come out on his feet. Probably will go for submission on the ground. Can he submit him? We don't know. Trading with the American Top Team, I already mentioned it. You know, these guys are really good. You better believe that he trained really, really hard on his submission defense, but even maybe on submissions itself. Like, uh, for him, the side mount, Americana. You know, with figure four. That is like a submission. Or, or, or Kimura, the reverse figure four. Those submissions are good for guys who are new in the game. Well, Lashley almost got caught in his last fight against Jason Guida in a guillotine choke. It looked like it could be over, and, and give Lashley credit. He, there's no way he was tapping out. He fought through it, and he said he learned a valuable lesson from that. Again, this is only his third professional fight. He does have the incredible wrestling background. Three-time national champion in wrestling. Of course, that was at Missouri Valley College and former WWE fighter. That's a whole lot of men right there. Well put, my friends. To the ring we go to Brad Kelly for the fighter introductions. Fight fans, this is the super fight of the evening. Make some noise! Three rounds in the MFC heavyweight division. Your referee is Big John McCarthy. Make sure your eyes are on him. Introducing first in the blue corner. He stands six feet, two inches tall and weighed in at 234 pounds with a record of seven wins and three losses. Fighting out of San Jose, California. The Animal Cook! And 
His opponent in the red corner, he stands six feet three inches tall, weighed in at 249 pounds, with a record of two wins and no losses. Fighting out of Denver, Colorado, Bobby the Dominator Lashley. Gentlemen, we went over the rules in the back and then we get yourself at all times. I want you to fight clean, fight hard, fight fair. Do I have any questions from you, Mike? Any questions from you, Bobby? You want to touch gloves, touch them now? Let's get it on. No touching gloves from nope. Bobby Lashley. You know, and a lot of men, you know, all those muscles need oxygen. You go like, ah, maybe he doesn't have it. But for him training in Colorado, 6,000 feet high, you know, he's got the altitude advantage you ready? here. You ready? We Let's have. The best in the business, Big John McCarthy, gets us going. Bobby Lashley and Mike Cook in this heavyweight battle. And right away, he's going for a guillotine. Lashley right? going for a guillotine. You let it go. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Bobby Lashley coming out. That's it. I, I thought he let it go, and then he re-gripped it again. My, yeah. I mean, no, with the strike like he has. Wow. But well, he said he wanted more ring time. He didn't get it. I yeah. think he'll take the victory. Very impressive. Bobby Lashley, the dominator. Well, that's a good nickname for him. He said that he wanted to fight six times this year, go 6-0, and oh, and get a win by every possible way. He already had the decision, he had the TKO, and now chalk up the submission. Nice. Very nice. So he already did what he wanted to do, pretty much. Halfway there. Bobby Lashley improves to 3-0. and Unreal. Wow, this is weird. There you go, the CompuStrike final stats. One strike thrown, one landed, one submission attempt. That's all it took. Goose eggs on the board for Mike Cook. My, if we're going to see the replay, Mike Cook was like flipping on the ground, like right. almost like in a, like faking it. <laughs> you got to check that out. Sizzling. Well, here comes the entire fight, right, boss. Lashley comes out. Watch, look at this. Look at how tight that is. Those are two. Huge meat hooks. What? Now he's got it. Watch. Now he he's starts. out. He starts moving. And Big John McCarthy stops the fight. What an impressive performance by Bobby Lashley. He sprawls him down, pushes his with the chest down, so the neck exposes, and that's it. Wow. And the Dominator celebrates. Not much love from the Canadian fans here. Let's make it official and head back to Brad Kelly. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout is ended at 24 seconds of the first round. Your winner by submission, rear naked choke out of the red corner. That was a rear naked joke. Nah, that was a guillotine. Well put. That's why you're the best, my friend. Well, everybody on the planet can see that one. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it was the first joke I won to fight with. Bobby Lashley improves to 3-0, and and the Dominator is standing by with Jason Greger. Here with Bobby Lashley. Well, Bobby, uh, quite the entrance, your first time here in the MFC. Talk a little bit about there is no hand tapping. Uh, you seem pretty annoyed by the uh, mask that Mike Cook was wearing. Well, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm here for business. Everybody comes out there with this wrestling thing and tries to make fun of the wrestling thing. I'm real. 
You know, I'm coming out here to fight. If they don't want to fight me, they can play around. If they play around, I'm going to knock them out or choke them out. And that's what I did today. Choked him out. Made him pay. Now he can go put back on the mask and have fun with himself. We're going to look at the highlight because really uh, this one was over quick. Just to, It looked like for a second you almost let it go. We're going to get to the highlight here because you had it and then it almost looked like you let it go. Talk us through it. Well, I, I wanted to move around a little bit. I've been working on my hands. Come my hands down a little bit. My boxing coach be a little mad for that. But I just yanked him down there and when I got the vice grip on, I had it around his neck and I just squeezed. I felt him going out. So I just yanked him flat and squeezed. Well, it was a devastating victory. Very, very impressive. Let's talk about your future. You talk about how you want to get ring time. Uh, that's not a lot of ring time there in this one. But looking ahead, what's the future plans? I got a fight next month. I'm fighting Bob Sat next month. So I'm going with a bigger guy. And um, I'm just going to keep going, man. Keep the competition rolling and keep the fights going. That's what I want to do. Well, Bobby, uh, impressive performance. Congratulations. I uh, hope to see you again soon. Thank you, man. I just want to thank Gamma O. I want to thank um, America Top Team, all the guys that I train with, Shane, um, Brandon, um, my boxing coach, Fareed Samad, Robert for coming down with me, and um, family at home, my kids, Kyra, Miles, here for you, and Crystal, thank you. Ron Boss, back to you. All right, Jason, a very happy Bobby Lashley. Quick work tonight improves to 3-0.